Welcome to another episode of PSLE Science Made Simple. My name is Jolie and I'm a PSLE Science Specialist from the PIG Lab. In this video, I'll be analyzing a past year examination question and I've included this question in the handout which you can download for free by clicking on the link in the description box below. Now without further ado, let's get started. The diagram below shows the growth of a bean plant but it is arranged in the wrong order. So what are we required to do? We are required to arrange the growth of the bean plant in the correct order by filling in the box below with A, B, D, E. And in the first box, we have C. Now, when students look at box C and they look at the diagram, they notice that for C, hey, it is actually a plant in its adult stage. How do we know that it is a plant in the adult stage? Because we can see that there are fruits present. So a common mistake students do is they get confused and then the funny answer they give is that they will actually draw or they will actually write an answer that shows the plant growing in reverse. What do I mean? It means that they will tell me it will go to C and then it will go to E and then it will go to B, A and then D. So the plant is basically shrinking back to a C. But what I would tell them is this, okay, for the plant to actually grow, it undergoes what we call the plant's life cycle. Okay, and when we use the word cycle, what's the meaning of cycle? It means that it is actually a sequence of events that repeats itself again and again. So there is no start, there is no end, but there is a correct sequence or correct order. So let's write this here to remind ourselves. A cycle repeats itself. So I'll tell the students, think about this. After the plant is in the adult stage, okay, with the fruits present, what is inside the fruits? There are seeds. So what would be the next stage after the adult plant? It will be the seed stage. So at this point now, they get it. They're like, oh, okay, so after the adult plant, it's the seed stage. But it doesn't mean that the adult plant becomes a seed. It means that now the adult plant has fruits, the fruits contain seeds, and that seed will actually grow into a new plant. So after stage D, which is the seed, we have A, because the roots will actually emerge first. Followed by B, which is our young plant. And finally followed by E which is our adult plant, where there are flowers present. And then after stage E, we have stage C again, because the flowers will develop into a fruit, and the cycle repeats. So this question is testing the students on the concept of a cycle repeating itself over and over again. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up. If you want to check out the other videos we have made, do click on the links on the right hand side. Last but not least, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos. I'll see you next time. Bye bye!